Today I'm going to show you the easiest and quickest way to do the, uh, I guess that's called the color splash technique in Final Cut Pro, or this also works in Final Cut Express. I've seen some weird ways to do it with chroma key on YouTube, and this is much easier, and I think it gives a better look. Uh, there's no borders. Anyway, I'm literally going to show you how to do this in under 30 seconds. You're going to open up your clip in the viewer, you're going to go to Effects, Video Filters, Color Correction, Color Corrector. Click on your Color Corrector. You're going to go to Limit Effect down bottom here. Click on your Color Picker. Choose the color you want to isolate. You're going to widen it just a little teeny bit. Widen the saturation and the luma just to make sure it looks good. Then you're going to pull the saturation down all the way. And then you keep adjusting it. You can hold down Shift with the picker to pick some more just like that. Make sure you have all the orange. Spread that out a little bit. Get some more luma in there. Uh, saturation. We can change that. Okay. I think we've just about got all of that orange isolated. Alright. Edge thinning. We can adjust that. You can soften it a little bit. Alright. See this little trapezoid? Inverts it. Bam. You render out your video. There you go. You've now isolated the color. Also, you uninvert that. Now you black and whited the orange. It literally is that simple. That's how to do the color splash technique in Final Cut Pro or Final Cut Express.